Hello everyone. Hello, the beginner coder of C programming. Today I'm showing you how to how you can make a simple tic tac token using by C programming. Well, um, I have tried my best to make it easy for you so that uh, you can make it easily. There are about 130 lines, um, and I think it's really. Um, I tried my best to make it simple. Okay, there is two header files. There are many several header files in C programming. I used here to the header file that is studio.h and conio.h. And I used the three functions that is check main, board, and main. And the function of void does not return any value. And the other functions is return value 0 or 1. Let's see how they return. Here is the main function that is written 0 and the checking function also written 0 or minus 1. And the void functions does not return any value. Well, there I allocated 10 characters, 0 to 9. Let's see what will be the output. You have to first compile the program, then you have to run it. Uh, I have uh, I already compiled my programming. Okay, let's say one to nine, and if I uh, disappear one value, then it will be output will be the missing. Okay, let's say now what will happen. I have to cross it and make it again debugging and run. Okay, there is number missing, and that is six, which I have disappeared in the previous time. Okay, I, again I input my value. Okay, now this is the main function, and there is the two. Uh, there is the number of the two, one, and two. Okay. Firstly, I have to Okay, now firstly I want to show you how I structured this model. Okay, and it will work in the uh, board function. And I have to use the class that is things a system. And the first line is will be the tic tac toe. And the uh, tic tac toe. And now the printed, uh, now that second line will be the player 1a1 one one and player 2. Okay. Here is shown the um, which I write in the printer. Okay. Now, uh, and it's the have to scanning by percentage C. And the uh, located space will be the square one, square two, and square three. Okay, let's see. One, two, three. Okay. Now the printer will be the second line which is here and it will look at the 4, 5 and 6. The same way the other lines will be also. Well, now let's see. Now uh, you have to choose your what is your player number and there is uh, will be the mark. And uh, the mark will be the and the character is the mark. And if your uh, choice and is uh, if your choice and is uh, if your choice is one, and your square mark is also be the one, then the mark will be the square one. Okay, let's have C. That is one. And if your choice is two and square is two, then the mark will be the two. Uh, that is the same way you have to do it that uh, nine. Uh, and if your choice 
will be the 9 and square 9 will be the fill up by other player numbers then which will be the invalid move such as I will show you how it happened okay player 1 enters the number of 2 and player 2 enters the number of 3 let's see player 1 is allocated for x and player 2 is allocated for o and if now player 1 is also type I want to type the 3 then it will be the invalid move that means if uh, your choice and square will be the uh, have to be the uh, have to be the same and it it cannot allocate it before time okay uh, well now you have to uh, print your uh, you have to enter a number of the player and you have to scanning by percentage debit uh, as it's uh, it is a number that's why I scanning percentage D well and the uh, number one pair is and the number one and the number two pair is O. Well, if your uh, valid is equal, then you have to, you have to pack you have to pack your player number. That's why it's a minus. And if your choice will be the uh, and if your choice will be equal to the checkmate function and it will be the one by one it will be happen such as uh, now I uh, press for one then now I press for six that means one by one it will be the increasing okay and when uh, and when it will uh, and when it, uh, it, uh, when uh, it will be uh, continued till the then the game don't return any value. The game will be return the value of one or my or zero. Uh, otherwise, that is that is will be the minus one. Okay. Uh, if it will be return one, that uh, that means the player will be the uh, win. If the player uh, if the player uh, can't if the player can't uh, return any the one or minus one value, then it will be the game draw game that means it returns zero minus one value will be remain till then your game is continued okay now there is the check-in function check-in functions uh, in, the, in the check in functions I will show you how your game will be win and how uh, will be your game will be draw okay if your uh, if your game is uh, okay Cross the output and let's say that if your game will be uh if your game if your move will be the one and two and two and three then it will be win or four and five and five and six it will be win seven eight or eight and nine it will be win or one and four four and seven two and five and five and eight three and six and six and nine otherwise three and five five and seven or one and five and five and nine okay let's see the uh conditions if you square one and you square two and you square three and you square two then it will be written one that means that the game will be win and if the player four and five and five and six then the game will be win because it's written the value one okay otherwise if uh if they don't return any value of one that means they maintain these conditions then it will be written zero that means the game will be draw Otherwise, the game will be continued till then the game will be win or drop. Okay, now I have uh, now let's see what it happened. Uh, if I want to get okay, the number one play allocated his space number five, and number two pair is allocated his space number two, one, one, and three, and now number one, seven. Seven, six, nine. Okay, let's say that player one is win. That means the player one returns his value one. That's why he's win. Okay, if it will happen like this, one, two. 
six five h four seven nine three look the game is not playing here that means it will return minus one till then the game will be the draw other or the game will be the okay now get the three now let's see the game is draw that means it's return the value of zero okay um, I have tried my best to make it easy for you if you have any questions then please put your comments in the comment box I will try to answer all of your questions. Thank you so much for watching my tutorial.